So everybody, it's that time of year again. Christmas has come around quickly. And here we have the... Uh, no, I'd, I'd say annual, but I didn't do one last year. The Christmas message from Arctic Monkeys. Obviously we haven't been around this year, you've probably been wondering what we've been doing. Well, we have the DVD release that came out. It's the box set, special edition, it's now available in uh, any any good retailer. So this was filmed last December, which is the last time we were all on stage together playing a gig. Which has been strange. I've missed the boys, obviously I've got all the, the photographs around here just to remind me of their faces. And yeah, I mean, it can get quite lonely, especially this year. And uh, this time of year is when we all get we get back together again and start thinking about what we're going to do next year, which will, you know, hopefully get back on the road. January we'll be out in Australia. As I say, we did a bit of recording this year in the desert with uh, Josh of, of the Queens of the Stone Age fame, which was great. I mean, we had a great time. Speaking of uh, releases, the other thing I've personally been up to this year, I did the uh, Late Night Tales compilation. It's by me, Matt Elders. Got the 7-inch, uh, which just features a single, a cover of Dreamer, the Living Joy Smash. The album and 7-inch. Actually, that's probably gone. It was only limited release. Probably none of them were. Album's still available, probably online, download, and, you know, your HMVs. This is something I'll be putting in all of the boys' stockings this year. Jamie, Alex and Nick will all get a copy of this. The other thing I've been doing this year, I opened a shop at the above a bar called The Bowery. So this is one of my designs. I think it's perfect for Alex. He does like a t-shirt with a, a pattern on. He's not, you know, he's, people probably think he's quite a plain, plain clothes guy, but you know, underneath it all, he actually co-created this t-shirt with me because he's that into patterns. And then I would say, no, I'll do a plain grey t-shirt, and he's, no, definitely get a pattern on there. Same with this jumper, he, he, he uh, insisted that I wore this today. Got this present, this is just some baubles, because um, Nick, on the side, what he's been doing this year, he's done a Christmas decoration business, which he's opened, which is, you know, he's, as you know, he's only busy one time a year, but... I've got him some special baubles there with his name on them. Jamie, I'm going to give him a signed photograph. A pair of shoes also from the shop, Supreme being there. And the, uh, it's a photograph I'm going to sign personally for Jamie. I don't know if you can get that. I mean, we'll probably, you know, he'll probably really appreciate that because that's, that's personal. That's something that's just from me to him. So, Nick, good luck because, you know, the current climate doesn't uh, doesn't go well for people starting a business, especially a Christmas decoration business. Love from Matt. We've we've been away for you. We've had uh, all this year to try, except for Alex, obviously with his the TLSP live experience, the Last Shadow Puppets. We've, that's been keeping him busy. Quite a Christmassy. I'm surprised they didn't record a Christmas song. Actually, that'd have been perfect. But. Um, but now we've got him back for a year of uh, more magic, I suppose. And, you know, magic's what Christmas is all about. So I'd just like to end by saying Merry Christmas, everyone, and we'll see you next year. <laughs> no, I can't do that. Maybe. <laughs> Mouth full of yeah no real beard people I don't know what they do. Oh, got it yeah yeah stained beard. They have stained beards. I don't think blonde people have got beards or grey.